everything is always possible for the start of the Tour de France on day one. And we're standing here at the finish of day one, Landerno. This summer, 180 kilometers from Brest to Landerno will decide the first stage winner. And I'm here with Sebastian Eno, sports director for Arkea Samsic. Sebastian, how important is the first day in a Grand Tour, the Tour de France? First, you can take uh, the jersey, yeah. <laughs> your yellow jersey. It's, it's important for the, for the rider, for the team. Just for one day, it's good, uh, yellow jersey. And it's also a stressful day of racing out there for the riders? Yeah, of course, because, uh, you know, each team is fresh. Every team has uh, the objective. Sometimes uh, it's a sprinter, sometimes leader for your GC. So uh, each team wants to be in the front. and. Uh, you know, the first stage is not so easy. It's a bit of climb, a lot more road, maybe wind, maybe rain, and uh, you never know. Stage one travels, of course, from Brest here to the finish line, and it's a mixed stage, a rolling stage, and it ends with a three kilometer climb. Now, the worst part is in the beginning. There's around 14% gradient in that first part, the first kilometer. Then we have around, I think, about two kilometers from that kilometer up here to the finish, two kilometers of around falls flat. It'll be grinding and the sprint teams could maybe take control there. We just don't know. What type of rider do you think this stage will suit? What type of rider do you think will win, see win on June 26th? I think there is many riders. Uh, GC leader, some sprinter, sprinter puncher. You never know, uh, La Philippe for Dekenheim. Uh, Van Aert for Jumbo Visma and maybe, uh, maybe Roglic also. Huh? Yeah, he finished uh, two in uh, Flesh Volant, so maybe he liked this finish. Pogacar is not so bad too. Van Der Poel, so there is a lot of rider. So we just don't know. A punchy rider, perhaps a sprinter. Tune in with us on June 26th to see who's crowned king, who wins the stage that day, and importantly, takes home the yellow jersey. It looks like it is Case Bowl who's going through the centre as Christoph arrives on the right hand side. Alexander Christoph is going to take stage number one of the Tour de France.